Pila gani entrance? Each name. Sir, each name is that. All right. Good morning, everyone. Today we're gonna hike this mountain, Muswan Peak, the mountain near my house. So I can just always see this from a distance. And now we're gonna go to the peak. Today's Mother's Day, by the way. Happy Mother's Day to all mothers out there. This is a Mother's Day hike. Here's the entrance to the mountain. And this is actually a forest. You can hear the, the sound of the forest. Insects, birds. And there are huts here where you can wait how to jump off or just relax if you don't want to hike. So join me as I climb this mountain all the way to the peak, Mount Muswan or Mount Kalayo. Oh, you can hear the sounds of the forest. We are now entering the pathway. The pathway is actually very huge. It's very wide for a for a typical for a typical mountain. Look, it's like even a car or even a vehicle can enter it. So this is just gonna be a relaxing hike. It's not gonna be a it's not gonna be a strenuous hike. This is level one hike here in Bukidnon for kids. This is for kids, guys. <laughs> this hike is for senior citizens and kids. Very easy. A level one hike. So if you have a family with kids, this is an ideal hike. If you're in Bukidnon, you can experience the mountain. You can experience the forest. But the trail is very easy. So an ideal family hike. You can hear the sounds of the forest it's amazing because i can just see this from a distance before this forest and now i'm here this is actually the, the starting point still a starting point although to begin with the elevation is already high it's already above sea level and we're gonna go all the way to the peak This is very popular for joggers, runners. Tarium yun? Kaya pala maingay kasi pag yung mahogan ni Sabol, hindi maingay, di ba? Ayun ang... Ito, Nara to. Ito, mga Nara, oh. Nara pala ng ganyan na. Talagang... Nara yan? Lokal nga ko, no. Sa Kalasungay may nara tayo. Nara to? Ang mga niwang? Hmm. Dikit dikit kasi. Niwang sila kasi dikit dikit. Dikit. This is Bukidnon Dairy where I buy caribou milk, goat's milk, fresh milk. The milk there is really good from Muswan, from Central Mindanao University. Alright, from here you can see Mount Kitanglad Mount Kitanglad This forest is actually protected by the government This is a protected land And there are still animals here like different kinds of birds and monkeys One of the things about Bukidnon is the presence of hiking destinations, climbing, trekking destinations with different levels. So if you want a hard level hiking, of course there always, there's always a second highest mountain in the Philippines which is Mount Dulang, Dulang Dulang, there's Kitanglad, a lot of other mountains. But this Mount Muswan is just level 1, I think it's even level 0.5 for kids for kids guys sayo pa ni Boy Tapang para lang to sa mahinang nila lang level 1 trek para sa mahinang nila lang 
according to Boy Tapo. Here's another cross. I think this is the third cross. Listen to the sound of the insects. Ayan. Quartz. Ah? Ano no? Ano yan? Quartz crystal. Totoo yan? Hindi yan glass? Parang hindi glass eh. Hindi siya glass. La? Saan pa? Hindi siya glass. Ayan. Hindi siya glass eh. Parang hindi glass eh. Kaya sa loob na yung mga ano. Formation na. the peak all the way from here that's the peak right there so if you notice the vegetation is changing from from a forested area to a kind of like just less trees more on grass at the top part of the mountain it's like more of kogon grass here at the top while at the bottom it's lush forest that's the vegetation of Mount Muswan I don't know if you can see but there hawks or eagles flying small eagles i think they're hawks they're just they're just gliding they're very common in bukidnon you can see a lot of them here they're hunting for mice chicks look at that that's a, an eagle over there i don't know if you can see it using a gopro camera this is wide angle so maybe it's quite far but i can see hawks they're very common in mountain view college as well a lot of them there oh look at those it's a nice sight to behold these majestic eagles hunting okay guys there's a crossroad shorter route so let's take I think it's more scenic because you have the view so on the right to the left or to the right we're gonna take the right path all right so if you guys come here I suggest you take the right because it's a shorter route they say and we're gonna run it's part of our morning exercise let's do this part of our you have to sprint I don't like jogging I like running sprinting high intensity exercise short duration but high intensity uphill uphill running Whew. 
So that's a high intensity run, short but high intensity. Whew. It's tiring. Oh, look at the view. There's a view here. They can stop for a while and rest. Whew. Here you can see, I think that is the central Mindanao University, CMU, if I'm not mistaken. One of the universities in Bukidnon. One of the good things about this hike, or this mountain in general, is there are not lots of people who are here. At the moment, it is just us. We have the place by ourselves. So that's that's really good because I don't like the crowd. I remember when I was in China, most of the mountains there are really crowded with tourists, mostly domestic tourists, but here you can have the place to yourself. This path is way better than the original one because you can ha you can have a view if you take this route butong butong Wala atang daan dito. Wala atang daan dito. Hindi <laughs> okay lang may view naman eh. Kasi hindi niya makakantong. Balik tayo, akit tayo talaga doon sa taas. Wala, balik siya. <laughs> Ano, okay? Ay, paakit ba? Okay guys, the right route is not correct. So if you want to go to the peak, take the left route. We we made a mistake, but it's okay because it's, it's very scenic here. But we're going to go back and go to the left route because we're going to go to the peak. So if you're going to go to the peak, don't take the right route. It was a mistake. We are back at the left turn, the left route, because the right route is not going up. So we're now on the on our way to the peak. So if you guys come here, when you go up the peak, take the left route. If you want to go to the peak, but the right route is more scenic. I mean the uh, the right route is more scenic but the left route is the one that is going to the peak the final ascent going to the peak this is the trail condition it's now the what is this ninth cross and still kind of like forested but not huge trees anymore Oh, 
Kaya taas na niyan. Minsan ba ano na dira ay fire grass? Ah. Ay gas fire. Kumain na. Kumain na. Yan mga inyam. This uh, the lower part. The lower part of this mountain is composed of grassland. Kogon grass I think. It's, it's nice because it's kind of like Batanes or New Zealand not really New Zealand but Batanes so you can imagine just camping over there it looks low here because we're high but if you're at a highway this is actually those are actually high already those grassland grass part of the mountain oh awesome view you have the mountain, the the flat land where the rice fields are, sugar cane, probably even corn. There's the river. There's the grass part of the mountain, and there are trees here going up. They say originally this is also grassland, but they planted trees. So you have pine trees over there. Pine trees are not endemic to this area, but they planted them. So it's kind of like there's a European feel to the mountain, but it's not native to the Fili to the, to the Philippines. I think pine trees. Okay, so if you're into pine trees, there are pine trees here as well, but they're not native to this place. They already planted them. All right, guys, this is the Valencia. Valencia this is Valencia estate you can see it from from here from almost the peak of Mount Muswan it's amazing because I am I'm, I'm just always seeing this mountain from that area but now I'm here and it's overlooking overlooking this subdivision Valencia estate and this is the diversion road Diversion Road and that's Mount Kitanglad. Mount Kitanglad. This is Polangi River and this is the the trail. Salita kayo. Great. Sa yung zoom nito ito. Ah, ano masasabi niyo sa Mount Muswan? Mount Muswan. Wala masasabi. Wala masasabi. Damn mountain. Parang hindi naman siya Igao. This is the conductor of singing, uh, singing Sons and Daughters. What can you say about Mount Buswan? Can you bring SD here? You want to bring? How about this is the soloist of MBC Academy? Sally, Sally the Ford song. <laughs> <laughs> and our mothers, what can you say? Mother's Day, Auntie Mimi. Kayo ma. Ay dito para may view. Dito kayo. Ay dito dapat kayo nag-interview pala. I invite you to come here in Muswan Peak. The view is awesome. What can you say? Majestic view and we celebrate it Mother's Day here with the family. Bye bye. Uncle Bong. What do you say? The father. Mount Kalayo. It's very beautiful. It's amazing. Alright, so I feel like a real vlogger using this camera. Every day. I'm the collector of the gem. So, what can you say about the quartz here in uh -huh. Mount Muswan. There are a lot of more crystals. <laughs> and the birthday girl, what can you say about girl. Mount Muswan? <laughs> and 
finally we've reached the peak. This is the cell site that we can see from the highway. This is kind of like the trademark of Mount Muswan, a peak with a cell site or a telecom site. It's a wonderful thing to see the actual community soaring on our way going down it was a great time spent at a peak and I love the part where I saw my house so it's nice to see it from here from this perspective seeing the whole community Pulangi River I think So Muswan Peak, really a wonderful hike, especially for beginners. Wonderful view, cool breeze, and wonderful company. It's a beautiful day. Listen to the ambience of this place, pine trees area, pine trees part of Muswan Peak. If you compare it to the beach in general, okay, there are beautiful beaches of course, but in general, generally speaking, I prefer vacations in the mountains compared to the sea. Cool breeze, wonderful view, awesome nature. So this is what I like about Bukidnon, there are lots of options in terms of mountains because it's a very mountainous province and my dream vacation is actually a vacation in the mountains in a log cabin in the mountains somewhere in a country where there's snow and it's in the winter, there's a fireplace and just relaxing whether that be with family, friends or a partner or solo as long as it's a, a cabin in the mountains in the woods in a country where there's snow so that is just some thoughts on a way going down Mount Muswan and you can see this side there's a, a scenery at the side of the mountain it's really good to be vlogging using this camera this is a camera of my brother, a Canon mirrorless camera. I usually vlog using my GoPro, my old GoPro. But here, I'm using the, the Canon, the camera of my brother. 
so thank you for joining me guys and if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel kindly subscribe and click the bell button so you get notified whenever I upload travel videos I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be sharing to you my travels using this channel using this platform so you'll have an idea as well of the place before you can go before you go and visit that particular place and also to I wanted to inspire people to travel more to go places to explore and to enjoy life to enjoy living the mountain on our way down back to the jump off of Mount Muswan see that there are cottages to relax so we're gonna continue the vlog. Thank you for joining us on our hike. But we're still gonna continue on, still gonna continue on filming at my house for the celebration of Mother's Day and my sister's birthday. So I'm gonna end the vlog here and I'll be on a separate vlog. Once again, thank you for joining me and don't forget to click subscribe.